translate this picture right here, five units right and one unit up. All right, so this is a translation. It's a transformation where all I do is take a shape and move it somewhere else. I don't rotate it, I don't flip it, I don't reflect it. It's just I take this shape and go quick. So let's do this, just because you might have a teacher that shows you this type of notation. I can write this guy out as if I'm moving it five units right, you take your X and you add five. Taking your X value and adding five means you're moving it to the right. Subtracting a number means you're moving it to the left. Since I'm moving it one unit up, I'm gonna say Y plus one. Plus one means I'm moving up. If it was minus a number, I'd be moving it down. Was it necessary for me to do that? No, but if you have a teacher, if your book is like, instead of giving you words, if it says translate according to this thing right here, well, that's what it means. Write five, up one. So let's move our shape. And just to be extra sweet, I'm going to list out the points when I'm done. When you move a shape, the best thing to do is you move it one point at a time. So it doesn't matter which one you start out with. I'll start out with T. Uh, five right and one up. So here's T, right? One, two, three, four, five, go one up. And when you label it, you label it T prime. That little apostrophe tells you that we have taken an object and moved it. The object before you move it is called a pre-image, and the object after you move it is called the image. All right, so before I write out what all these are, let's do the rest of these. So I'm still going one at a time. Go right one, two, three, four, five, up one, put a dot there, call it G prime. Go to B. Go right one, two, three, four, five, go up one, put a dot there, call it B prime. And then of course I'm going to do my best connecting these dots, knowing very well that this is my greatest weakness and I'm doing all right, baby. Now the shape didn't change. It didn't get bigger, it didn't get smaller, it didn't flip, it didn't rotate. When I translate, all I do is move it. So here's my pre-image, here's my image. Let's list out our new points in no particular order. G prime has me starting at the origin, going right one, two, don't move up or down. So right two, don't move up or down is two, zero. T prime, not to be confused with T pain, is I start at the origin, go right one, two, three, four, don't move up or down, so four, zero. And B prime has me starting at the origin, go right one, two, go down one, two, three, four. So right two, down four is negative four. And those are the points of my image. So again, translating says, let's just move a shape. Don't do anything fancy. When I'm done, if you have to list out the points, there they are. Pretty simple.